So we're standing in the middle of the Pilliga and uh, outside of a Santos facility. This is Joe Evans, who's been part of the Northwest Protection Alliance. Joe, what's um, what's going on here? So this project is 95,000 hectares in size. There's going to be 850 plus wells. It is going to fragment the Pilliga Forest, which is the biggest inland forest in eastern New South Wales and home to uh, over 200 plus species of fauna. Flora, I cannot count them. It's been an amazing season out here. Who knows how much is here? There's things we haven't even found yet. I think the project is really going to damage the ecosystem here, particularly the water. The, the waste salt, we're looking at about 830,000 tonnes of salts waste. Um, it's not a clear, there's no clear plan to deal with that. So you mentioned you were quite concerned about impacts on water, on the water table. What's going on with the aquifers? Okay, so what happens is when they, when they drill for gas, they have to dewater that aquifer to enable the gas to flow. And the dewatering of the aquifer can cause that pressure in the aquifer to drop. And then all the bores will become unusable because they won't be working anymore. And this is a major concern of the farming community of the Northwest. They're incredibly concerned for their water because once that underground water source is polluted or they can't reach it anymore, then they can't farm. They can't even be here. So we've got an already existing primary industry that is a massive boon one of the biggest food producing areas in the state that is under threat from this short term industry. Jo, how did you get involved in, in this campaign? What, yeah. what sparked it for you? Uh, what sparked it for me was that um, Matt Gasco came to the Northern Rivers and they tried to drill wells there. So that was near my home. And then I came to the Pilliga and I absolutely fell in love with the Pilliga and I just can't bear to see the same thing repeated here that has been that has happened in Queensland.